Enoch held a profound understanding of the Bible, recognizing its foundational principle that everything begins with God. The book of Genesis, the Bible's starting point, echoes this truth, stating, in the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. The opening chapters of Genesis unfold the narrative of creation, the fall of humanity, and the introduction of sin. In the midst of genealogies tracing from Adam to Noah, a unique figure emerges in the fifth chapter, Enoch. Unlike the others mentioned, Enoch did not experience death. Genesis chapter 5 verse 21-24 reveals that Enoch lived in close communion with God, walking faithfully for 365 years. His exceptional fate, avoiding death and being taken by God, raises the question, how did Enoch walk with God? Hebrews sheds light on Enoch's life, emphasizing that faith was the key. In Hebrews chapter 11 verse 5-6, it is affirmed that Enoch pleased God through faith. Unlike others, Enoch believed in the unseen God, demonstrating faith that pleased God. True Bible faith, as exemplified by Enoch, involves trusting God for salvation, viewing death as a transition to the Lord, and maintaining trust in God amidst life's challenges. Enoch's faith was more than a mere side-by-side -side walk with God, it was a faith walk. He consistently aligned his life with God's direction, focusing on what pleased God. This unwavering faith set Enoch apart. While living in a sinful and lawless generation, Enoch's close relationship with God allowed him to prophesy about the future, foreseeing the Lord's return and the judgment upon the ungodly. Enoch's life serves as an example of walking with God in an age of deception. True Bible faith, rooted in trust and obedience, brings fulfillment and aligns with the purpose of pleasing God. It transcends circumstances, remaining steadfast in the face of challenges. In a world lacking purpose and hope, True Bible faith offers a pathway to please God, fulfilling the ultimate purpose for which individuals were created. Enoch's message to his generation echoes through time, a call to repentance and a warning of the impending judgment of God. Living with a profound awareness of God's righteous judgment, Enoch preached righteousness to his contemporaries. His prophetic words reverberate with urgency, repent, Jesus is coming to execute judgment. In a world often shrouded in darkness and rebellion against God, Enoch's unwavering faith and close communion with the divine granted him insights into the future. The prophecy recorded in Jude chapter 1 verse 14-15 reveals Enoch's foresight, spanning over 5,000 years from his time. He spoke of the Lord's second advent, a day when the Lord would come with thousands of his saints to execute judgment on the ungodly. Enoch's revelation underscores a fundamental aspect of God's nature, his role as a just judge. His words serve as a stern warning to those living in spiritual darkness and defiance. Every ungodly word and deed, he declared, would be brought into account before the righteous judgment of the Lord Jesus Christ. In our present age, where deception and sin abound, Enoch's example beckons us to walk closely with God, to cultivate a faith that pleases him. True Bible faith is not only a shield against the trials of life but also a beacon of hope that transcends the limitations of our earthly existence. It empowers believers to face the challenges of an uncertain world with unwavering confidence in the sovereign God. As we navigate the complexities of life, Enoch's legacy encourages us to maintain a focus on what pleases God. In a world filled with distractions and temptations, the call to walk with God and live a life aligned with his principles is as relevant today as it was in Enoch's time. The secret of Enoch's extraordinary life lies in his unwavering faith, a faith that pleased God. His story challenges us to examine the foundation of our faith and to seek a closeness with God that transcends the ordinary. In doing so, we, too, can find the fulfillment that comes from living a life that pleases our Creator in a world desperately in need of his light and truth. Enoch's life serves as a beacon in a world filled with uncertainties and moral ambiguities. In the midst of societal upheavals and personal struggles, his unwavering faith stands as a testament to the transformative power of a genuine relationship with God. In the fast-paced and ever-changing landscape of our modern world, the call to walk with God remains just as crucial. Enoch's example challenges us to prioritize our spiritual journey, 
seeking a profound connection with the divine amidst the noise and chaos of daily life. In our pursuit of faith, it's essential to reflect on the nature of our relationship with God. Are we walking with him, aligning our steps with his divine guidance? Enoch's faith walk was marked by consistency. He didn't walk ahead or behind God but with him. This deliberate choice echoes through the ages, encouraging us to keep God as the primary focus of our lives. Enoch's life also highlights the importance of faith as the cornerstone of a pleasing relationship with God. The writer of Hebrews emphasizes that without faith, it is impossible to please God. This profound truth transcends cultural and temporal boundaries, challenging believers of every era to cultivate a deep and abiding trust in the unseen God. The modern world often bombards individuals with conflicting messages, fostering doubt and skepticism. Yet, true Bible faith, like Enoch's, goes beyond what the eyes can see. It involves trusting God not only when he answers prayers but also when the journey is marked by challenges and uncertainties. Enoch's prophecy about the Lord's second coming serves as a timeless reminder of God's justice. In an era where moral relativism often prevails, Enoch's words stand as a firm declaration that there will be a day of reckoning, a day when every ungodly deed and word will be brought before the divine tribunal. As we navigate the complexities of our world, Enoch's legacy challenges us to be prophetic voices, heralding the truth of God's impending judgment and the hope found in a relationship with him. In a society desperately seeking purpose and fulfillment, the message of Enoch resonates. True satisfaction comes from pleasing the Creator, walking by faith, and embracing the transformative power of an authentic connection with God. Enoch's life story, encapsulated in the seemingly simple phrase, and he was not, for God took him, invites us to explore the depths of faith and intimacy with God. It beckons us to walk in a manner that pleases the divine, allowing our lives to be a testimony to the enduring power of a faith that transcends the ordinary and points toward the eternal.